Hi, my name is Tamika. I'm from Maynardville Public Library, and today I'm going to be reading Mary Had a Little Plan by Tammy Sauer, illustrated by Vanessa Brantley Newton. Mary had a little plan that sprouted on the spot. It all began the day she passed a drab abandoned lot. A stretch of mess, a marked up wall, the ground was wild with weeds. Then Mary took a look around. I know what this place needs. A cleanup and an overhaul, a garden path or two. The right, the, the right design will be divine. There's tons that I can do. So Mary wheeled in cans of paint and trimmings for the trees. She studied every fabric choice, the possibilities. She sent requests to local shops for flowers, tools, and wood, and trucks soon barreled down the road to help the neighborhood. Then Mary gathered bags of trash. It took her half the day. The sight of so much left to do consumed her with dismay. Oh, what a mess, I must confess, I'm really in a bind. But when a spider sat beside her, something came to mind. So Mary asked her friends for help. They didn't hesitate. Hooray, said Mary, follow me. It's time to renovate. Soon Bo Peep's sheep went in knee deep. They chomped the weeds away. A cleanup crew knew what to do to fix the disarray. The flower beds were organized in neat and tidy rows while Jack and Jill went up the hill and watered with the hose. Miss Muffet created cozy seats. The others worked the wall. Another built a nook for books, and they were free for all. With twinkling lights strung overhead and grass beneath her feet, Sweet Mary added one more thing to make the scene complete. All are welcome. Then Mary gathered with her friends. She marveled at the view. This little lot was spot quite the spot. It showed what love can do.